What up, what up everybody? Today I'm walking up the Gediminas Castle Tower and the entrance is just up here on the left. So uh, it's kind of just outside of the Bernadine Park. Really easy to find. Probably one of the most visible spots in this part of Old Town. And it's about 11.30 in the morning. Got great, great weather today. Uh, just about 68 degrees Fahrenheit. And uh, low, low humidity. It's kind of my ideal weather. And uh, yeah, thought I'd get out and get a little hike in. I've been trying to get this place for about a week now and it's just been either overcast or rainy so I'm gonna try to tilt the camera upwards so you can kind of see the the hike they do have a wheelchair accessible entrance on the other side from what I saw you might have to call and double check and most of the museums are quite good about that having ramps everywhere some of the older sites have to be retrofitted views of the town you can already see we're we're flying like doves Castle, also known as Gediminas Castle, is considered a symbol of Vilnius, built at the beginning of the 14th century. Wow, super cool. Let's take up a little higher so we can get some views. other side of the city. Thank 
See where we're walking is facing towards the Three Crosses Monument, which is a higher viewpoint and completely in nature. <laughs> So enjoying this weather today. See, it's just looks like pretty modern stones down here. Let's go look at a view of facing north overlooking the nearest river and we've been across this bridge before the radio tower off in the distance Sorry about that. I've got some humidity inside this uh, this camera on the front lens. It's a GoPro GoPro 9, but I had it in like super air conditioned room, and I walked outside. So thin little layer of humidity on the on the front made it hard for me to see. Right. So I guess you can go up in that tower, but I kind of. Uh, maybe I should try it. Why not? I'm here. Hello. Hello. Go? Okay. okay. Yeah. 
Thank you. Looks like here, we got the Lithuanian flag flying high. And then that's where we were just down there. We came up in this entrance. Downstairs. Oh, man, it's the perfect weather today. And again, the Nares River. Super cool. All right. For the descent of man. Their noggins right here. It's literally chest plate right now. Bye-bye. 
All right. Cool, that was nice. I'm glad I went up there. Tell you with all this, whatever you think, either way about all this COVID stuff, it's so nice to be in a country that doesn't take it. They they take vaccines seriously. If you want to go get a vaccine, it's easy and it's free. But they don't fuck. They don't fucking ruin everybody's life. If you don't put your mask on all the time, it's like public spaces, enclosed public spaces. You have to be masked up, but even that's like questionable. But like, not restaurants, not cinemas, nothing like that. Meanwhile, in France, the cops are going around like the Gestapo, fucking finding people. I think if you're one of the the worst countries in Europe for rolling out the vaccine, you can't also go find people for not wearing a mask. You have to pick one one side. A man rocking, rocking church clothes. I guess it is Sunday. It's nice hearing the church bells on Sunday here. you can see this part is slightly slightly treacherous Alright folks, well that was cool, thanks for coming along for a walk, and I will catch up with you all later. <laughs>